How you doing? All right, so, so I finished talking with uh, Queenie about all this, and I'm willing to own up to my actions if you will let me. Okay. Willing to take responsibility for my actions if you will let me own up to it. If that makes sense. <coughs> um, that would be. That would. I'm referring to the 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 liking the comment. I'm willing to own up to that. I understand it's not exactly the most neutral thing I could have done, especially since obsessed isn't even a word that I would use. So, you know what? You get what I mean. So then, why'd you like it? I don't know. Basically, because I felt that I was that I was alone, the only person who was kind of getting annoyed with all the drama. And when I saw someone else saying something in that same sort of realm, I'm like, "Cool, I'm not alone after all." You know that type of thing. I mean, I pretty much told a lot, a lot of this, pretty much everything related to this thing uh, to Queenie, just just now, a little while ago, before I was added in here, so. Right. Well, here's the thing. I don't give a crap if you're neutral or not. I don't care if you take my side. I don't care if you take Rep's side. I don't care if you take the damn fart uh, in the corner side. Choose, choose something. Don't keep going back and forth and confusing the crap out of me because that confuses the crap out of me. And then I'm going to be like all pissed off about this because you're like, yo, are we cool and all this kind of stuff. But then you, you broadcast that and then you're going to be like, oh, you know, I'm going to like this comment that says he's obsessed with Repsion, even though he has every right to be pissed off about this entire situation because I he just I never, got found the DMCA. I never said that you didn't have a right to be upset, and I understand that you are upset. But then you like something that says I'm obsessed, and it's you're basically agreeing with that person, saying, yeah, why are you so obsessed with this guy on a post that involves something that's actually pretty damn recent? You know, this is not like some sort of little Tumblr post where he's saying something that's contradicting or stupid or hypocritical or anything like that, even though there's no no damn wrong thing about doing that. It doesn't say I'm obsessed about the guy. It's obvious I can easily do, like, a public search of his damn tumblr and then easily see whatever he says that's stupid it's not like i can't do that kind of stuff it's not like i'm trying to go to his damn house and then search for his damn belongings and, and take his damn underwear and burn it alive i am just proving that this guy is full of himself and you know i don't see how that's a, anything of an obsession or wrong or anything like that and to top it all off it was on something that was involving something with me, with my channel being terminated potentially if I ever get any more strikes. And considering this is full-on censorship, I have every right to be pissed off about this, and it doesn't mean I'm obsessed about it at all. Anybody who thinks that must be really damn shallow to think that I'm being obsessed when I'm being highly censored constantly every damn day or every damn week with some like damn I just, false privacy complaint or damn false DMCA. Like I said, you have every right to be upset. I'd be pretty pissed too if somebody did that on my channel. Well, yeah. So then that's why I'm trying to say, what would be the point in liking something about me being obsessed? Well, like I said just a little bit ago, I would have definitely used a different word than obsessed. But basically, where I'm coming from, I'm getting annoyed with a lot of the drama, you know, clogging my feet and whatnot. It's just a little bit annoying for me, but I'm doing People my best. Keep saying, man. People keep you know, saying I'm, they're getting annoyed at the shit out of what I say about Repsion, but I don't see them doing jack shit about what, what's going on with Onision, and you even made a video with a collaboration to Stevie's video on something that's been beaten to death for years, so I don't see how that's a big issue, and then there's also the UTF drama that you've been also a part of and actually liked as well, and didn't have any say about that either, because, I mean, I, I was on and off with UTF for maybe a year or more than a year and I didn't see you on my case about that and saying oh you know he's obsessed or anything like that or saying I'm perpetuating any type of drama or anything like that kind of situation this has to do with you know at first starting something civil 
ending up becoming hostile on his end, and then ending up with me being censored to death constantly. So I don't see where's the obsession. I don't see me, you know, uh, being in the wrong in any sort of way about this. He deserves every single thing what's coming to him. He deserves the taste of his own medicine since he's so full of himself, just like Onision is full of himself and he got on his ass constantly and even decided to follow his own damn wife on Tumblr at one point. So, the point I'm trying to say is that if you're really annoyed with what I have to say and you think it's really annoying and all this kind of stuff, there's a feature on Facebook where it says hide. And, you know, if I was annoyed with Repsion stuff, you know, whatever, whether it be videos or whatnot, I would hide it. I would unsubscribe. I would do something like that. But I don't say I'm annoyed and say stop posting this and all that kind of stuff. I do, I do that for, as far as the suicidal stuff because that's actually impacting a lot of people. You being impacted by me saying something what, what's wrong and right about what Repsion's saying doesn't impact you in any sort of way in a negative light, maybe a little bit, but it's mostly just your whole, you know, appreciation for Repsion that is getting impacted by that. This has to do with suicide and all this kind of stuff, so I don't see how that's anything wrong, you know, to say stop doing that. But... If you really are annoyed at me just criticizing somebody validly about something, whether or just pointing out something that's stupid on his end to say, just don't look at it or hide it or not even like my page at all or just not even see my feet. That's fine. I'm tr- I'm trying my damnedest to you know to just you know move right along. And for the record, I'm I don't want to to unfollow or anything because I respect you. I still do. You're still one of my favorite YouTubers and it would be a shame for me to, you know, turn my back on this, to turn my back on you, not the fucking... You're not turning my back if you dislike my page. It's not going to do anything to me. It's like, if you have that kind of situation where you're annoyed with what I have to say, then... I understand completely if you want to move on, because I do post a lot about Repsion for a damn good reason, though. But if you really have a problem with it and you don't want to hear about it, then you can just kindly move away from it and not even pay attention to it. Because that's what I did when, you know, when I was a big fan of the Young Turks, you know, when they would make videos about Republicans in such a biased way. I would always say, you know, I'm really kind of getting sick of this kind of crap. So then I just unsubscribed. That's how it went. You know, if you're really annoyed at something, you you move on from it. This kind of situation where I'm trying to prove him wrong and all this kind of stuff, you know, he can say whatever he wants that's stupid. He could say, you know, Japanese food to something that's actually Chinese food. I'm not going to tell him to, you know, to not say that or anything like that. The only thing I have a problem with is the suicidal stuff, and that's it. And I have every right to, you know, to say that kind of stuff is wrong and for him to stop doing that it's not that it's annoying it's and that like i and it like helped. i told you and it's like that I, and it like, ruins people and like i told you back when we last spoke about this i told you that i thought he was handling this very poorly and i still think he is yeah so like i said you know if you really have a problem with it you know <laughs> I mean, it's and you're not really alone with this. Uh, I'm sure Take Shot will just as much agree with you. I'm sure Lachlan will just as much agree with you, and as well as Mega, even though Mega's a damn dimwit. Um, but Mega, I think, shouldn't have gotten involved with there. Mega, he's an all right guy in my book, but nah, this isn't really his place. Mega doesn't know anything he's talking about. As much as Lachlan either, you know, it, it seems like none of these people that are trying to go against this situation Lachlan, understand. Lachlan's, Lachlan, like, Lachlan's just trying to be a good friend. He was messaging me a little bit about this. He actually wanted to be brought into a call about this, if that's okay. I'm not sure if he's online right now or if he's even awake right now, but, you know, he, you know he's just trying to be a good friend, you know. 
Except that's what's Lachlan's deal. And he's telling me the same damn thing. He's like, telling me I can kind of say the same thing about the Repsion drama. It gets sick on my side. Especially since I'm like, I'm like to your MDA page. And I'm just like, if you're annoyed, then just hide it. And he's like, but several people like your posts and it pops up in my feed. It's almost inevitable that I'll see it unless I remove everyone. Again, you have the option to hide those from your feed. You don't have to unfriend them. There's the hide button. Hiding has been going on for years. Yeah. You can use it. It's it's there. You don't even have to do it for statuses. You can do it for like liking on statuses. You don't have to see everybody's liking on statuses or liking on, or comments on statuses. You can just see their posts. All right. That's that is fine. <clears throat> uh, like, if that's the case, too, you know, if, if people, your friends are liking what I'm saying about Repsion and you really have a damn problem about it, there's that option. You know, you, all you have to do is go onto their profile and they have, like, a bunch of weird options on there. But then, like I said, you know, I, there's a reason why I'm pissed off about this. You know, the DMCA was the first thing that got to me, but then there was... There was you just put liking something that somebody said about me being obsessed, and that really blew my mind because, you know, that that really I was just enraged enough already. But then, that's fine, know, and, I under, and, and I understand that you're enraged. That's cool. You have every right to be enraged. And then you know it blew my mind even more when I seen you know people like Lachlan and Mega and whoever else was getting in on it. It it just really rub me the wrong way when I'm when I'm I love just how, like, I love I love how you call Mega young when he's like forty or something. I called him young. I, did, did you call him young? Young people uh, like Lachlan and Mega, you said. Um, I don't think I did. <laughs> well, whatever. I, I just heard young, but maybe you said something different. I said I said check his about section buddy but that was about it um let me see but yeah mega ain't no little kid he may no, act I'm... like one sometimes but you know uh, oh my god i keep getting damn freaking notifications see this 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 is the type of stuff that annoys me but like i said i kind of need to see what the hell's going on uh, at the same time oh so I filed a counterclaim on that damn DMCA, even though I shouldn't have to. Right, I saw. Him. Right, I saw your picture. <sighs> All right, so I, f I filed a counterclaim. I'm waiting on the response. I guess I don't know what. How does this work, dude? Like, if I if I submit a counter counterclaim and like. I get it back, does it go back to its original form or do I have to re upload it like a bitch? Re upload it on your side channel if you really want to upload it anywhere else. I shouldn't have to do that shit. That shit's staying up. It's already re uploaded on everybody else's channels. Yeah, a bunch of people are re uploading that. Man. Repsion doesn't respond with a certain amount of time to your counterclaim, it gets reinstated. Cool. But, uh, yeah, since, <laughs> since you filed a false uh, claim against me, I, I decided to file a false claim against him because I don't want him having my personal information. Sorry, that's not happening. I don't want that psychopath who disclosed a public marriage license and, and was following people's uh, families and trying to message them to go on and know my damn personal info. And, and Doodle's completely right. You have no option to do the, the damn email. Um, when I fi filed the counterclaim, I didn't have any option for my email. So the email is completely accurate. There's no doubt about it. Like, he's going to find out my Gmail, most likely. And, and the response, I'm guessing. I don't know if that's the case. I'll tell you this right now. Part of my respect will die down if he tries to reveal your personal information. Part of my respect will die down if he tries to do that. I will tell you that right now. Well, that doesn't 
have had that's not going to happen because I didn't give him my personal information. What but, you just said, what you just said, he's going to find out about my Gmail or something like that. But if he, yeah, ends, but that's not going to do shit. Oh, like, okay. Oh, he's got my Gmail. What's he gonna do? Yeah. You know, like, what the uh, fuck is he gonna do with that? No, you know, never, unless he has some Never hackers. mind. But yeah, I mean, but if he ever played a part in trying to leak personal information, respect will die down a little bit. I don't even know how respect didn't die down completely, like cancer on a damn chemo patient. Uh, it's just like this guy is fucked. He has nothing to stand on.